Hey guys, it's Emily. So I'm going to be showing you guys how I apply my false eyelashes today. Um, I just woken up, so sorry about the hair. And those are the lashes I'm going to be using today. I have a review. I will link that down below for you guys to go and check out. They're very inexpensive. For these particular lashes, though, I have to bend these around my finger because they are packaged straight instead of curved. But if you're just buying the ones at the drugstore that are already curved, you can just completely skip this step and you don't even have to do it this long. Um, now I'm going to get my glue ready if I can. This is the Duo um, Eyelash Adhesive in Clear White. Um, it goes on white, dries clear, and it's also waterproof. I really love this um, glue. It lasts all day. The only thing that is a con is the scent. It smells, I just, I don't even know. It smells so disgusting a little bit, but it goes away. I don't know. It's just not the best, but it work, the glue works really, really well. So I'm just going to take that and apply that to the band of the strip lashes and I just take and spread it on and then I take the end of the tube and spread it a little bit more evenly. I like to apply a generous amount because I want to make sure that it gets glued down well onto your um, lash line, I guess. It takes a while to dry so it's very time consuming. If you guys want to see a tutorial on the look I'm wearing right now, please let me know in the comments down below. But you want to let this dry. For about a minute or so until the glue becomes tacky and you'll see that it's become tacky because it kind of gets a little translucent. Um, I'm going to go ahead and curl my lashes with this Tweezer Man Lash Curler. This is just a travel size one but I really like it so far. My lashes are ready to go so I'm going to go ahead and apply those. I didn't really get the best shot at this. My hand was in the way. I didn't realize that I had to get that close to the mirror, but um, I just applied it as close to the lash line as I can and on top of my eyeliner and just press it on and it should be good if it's tacky. It should just go on automatically and of course there's always a struggle. Something always goes wrong so I did end up getting a little bit of glue on the bottom but it's fine. I wiped it away and just kind of play with it until you're happy with it and kind of let that dry. Um, on the other side I am just going to show you what the finished look looks like and um, I'm going to be taking this Benefit Magic Ink liner and I'm going to do it on over top of the glue. It does take this glue a little bit to become clear especially if you did it a little bit messy so I just like to go back over top of it that way while it's drying you can just go out the door and you're fine you don't look like there's glue all over your face. So I'm just going to take that and just trace back over top of the glue so you can't see that anymore and uh, just let that liner dry. I'm going to be taking this eyelash, what the heck, this mascara, it's, I don't know what the brand is. I'll have everything I um, use listed down below. I do have a review for this, but we're not sure if it's up yet, but I'm just going to blend my real lashes in with the fake lashes with this mascara. It's good for separating, and it adds some length, too, if you just want to wear it by yourself, by itself, but I just have been using this to blend my lashes together. Alright guys, and that's the finished look. I hope you guys enjoyed. Again, if you do want to see a tutorial for this look, please let me know in the comments down below, and I would love to do it. I was just playing around. Um... But I hope you guys like this, and I hope this was easy, and I will talk to you guys later. Bye.